my hands, I feel like I can own it. What's up, y'all? It's Uji, your best friend's best friend, doing my very first interview with my boy, FADs. What's up, what's up, what's up? You know the drill, you feel me? <laughs> Alright, we're gonna get into some questions, figure out who he is. He's about to be on the map, so let's, let's get into it. Where you from? From Jersey, Permanent Heights, New Jersey, you feel me? Down there in Burlington County, South Jersey, shit, you know the drill, you know what's going on. I'm a Jersey girl myself. I'm from up top. I'm originally from Connecticut, but all my family in Jersey, so I respect it. And there it is. And there it is. <laughs> so let me ask you, at what age did you realize you wanted to get into music? Uh, I probably was like, I mean, I started writing songs when I was like 12, but my pops was like, yeah, my dad, he like, he a model and shit, you feel me? Like, he's kind of into entertainment, and I used to show him my song to you, you know what I'm saying, about I want to say like last November, I want to say, yeah, like last year when I broke my leg. I was in college, I got leg. So then after that, I just leaned back on what I knew, music. And it's just, it flowed. Like, I feel good, I feel comfortable doing it. So, that's, that's the best good, follow your passion. Yeah, so it's, 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 it's a weird thing, it just came back from here. Yeah. So, what would you say your style of rap is? Uh, I would say like, I mean now, the way music is now, I couldn't, I can't say, but I definitely want to be labeled as like a rapper, like for sure. Like, like I don't want to say like the greatest, like Biggie and them, but I'm saying like that's me. I want to do that, like that gangster shit. Would you feel me? Be me, be myself, be comfortable. Like, you know what I'm saying? Relate to people at the same time. Like, yeah, shit like that. So I would say my style just hip hop, rap, just regular, straight. Street rap? Yeah, straight to it. You know? Okay. So, what you, you got your current project you're working on? Um, I dropped, uh, I, I, I took a trip to San Diego, and when I came back from San Diego in, um, in January, I did a little quick project real quick, and um, uh, it dropped on the 25th. It was on um, all platforms, Apple, Tidal, everything. Just go look it up, have ADs, all caps. Um, but I got another one I just dropped, Surprise EP, I dropped about last week. I don't know the specific date, but I dropped it last week, called Finally Spring. Go check that out, four tracks, bangers, featuring my man Bucks, too, from Jersey. Shout out to my mans. Okay, so give the people your your handle so they can know how to find these songs, these hits. Word, word, word. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, shit, Facebook, when my granny be checking it at HefeDs. Everywhere, anywhere, HefeDs. Google me, get my searches up, HefeDs. You can find it all. It's everywhere. So let me ask you, what do you feel um, keeps you going now, especially since music is such a competitive industry and everybody's into music or trying to get into it? I mean, I, I honestly, I feel like it's just, it's, 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 it's great music everywhere, and I know when I was coming up in Jersey, my cousins, you know, Grammy and K Slum Auto, they were making music, and at the time I was playing sports, but like they had a big like influence on the town, and music was just like a real big influence on what we had going on. So once the, once they got all locked up, free my man, free my bros, free my family, once they got locked up, you know, I just felt like we gotta just keep, you know what I'm saying, spreading that voice from our hood, because it's not like too productive. People be like, oh yeah, you know what I'm saying, Sunbury, you know what I'm saying, that shit trash, it's ghetto, da da da. So I just wanna keep a good voice. It's a good name, you know what I'm saying? A good tune coming from where I come from. So I think that that's my motivation every day. And I got a good support system from my bros out there. Like they working too. Like, that's a lot that's going on. Up. So if you could work with any artists, who would that be? Um I mean, I, like, I, I, I don't want to, you know what I'm saying, give you some simple and some short answer, but I mean, if I can work with anybody, of course, it's always going to be my bros. Like, I even got bros that, you know what I'm saying, do their own thing that I want to work with. You know what I'm saying? My bro Shotter, you know what I'm saying? My bro Mir. But I mean, people like in the game, in the in game, the game, like, yes. I probably would like, it would have to be me, like, Meek Mill. Like, that's my favorite artist. Like, I just know that, you know what I'm saying? I go into the studio with him. It's not just we making a song, it's a learning experience. It's a, we about to do this and we about to learn how to, you know what I'm saying, progress in your flow. You going like you know what I'm saying? It's all about, you know what I'm saying, learning. So I'm not gonna learn a lot from somebody like him coming from that that same area, not from Philly, but it's all in like a 20 mile radius. You know what I mean? So you know. And my last question for you. What is one piece of advice you would give to other up and coming artists trying to get in the industry? Um, I would say to other up and coming artists uh, in the industry, I would just say, yo, just keep, you know what I'm saying, keep grinding. Keep doing your thing, you know, it's always, every day you're gonna come to somebody coming like, oh, you can't do this, you can't do that. It really don't matter at the end of the day, it's all about what you think you can do. I know it's cliche, but that's the truth. Like, confidence is key. Confidence is key. I had a conversation with my yeah, about confidence earlier. Like, <laughs> confidence is key. Like, if you're confident and you're comfortable, them two big C's, you're good. You can, you can do anything you want. So just stay confident out there, do your thing. Don't let nobody tell you nothing. My cousin Grammy said, never let another man stop you from doing you. So don't, you feel me? That's right. Okay, again, 
thank you for checking in with me and Hefe D's. Make sure y'all follow him on all his social media handles. Go buy his albums. Go stream them. Let's go. Let's and support. Go.